fact or myth, anyone can become a pen tester? We're going to answer that question right now. What's up, guys? This is Ryan from Elevate Cyber. Is it true that anyone can become a pen tester or only the select few, right? Now, my answer to this question is actually that not anyone can become a pen tester, but bear with me. Bear with me for a second, right? I'll explain what I mean by this, right? So in order to become a pen tester, right? We talk about this field a lot, obviously, on this channel, right? And one thing that I say about it is that you have to have the mindset of being a self-learner, right? Someone that's learning stuff on the side. I mean, yeah, you can learn things from training, certifications like OSCP, as I advocate on this channel, and, uh, you know, my content that I create as well, right? You can learn things from other people, from all these other spaces, right? And even, you know, the more traditional routes of certs and stuff like that. But ultimately, you need to be always seeking out knowledge, always seeking to learn more and more, right? Because technology is continuously evolving and there's just so much to learn and uh, no, no one knows everything in security, right? I mean, it's absolutely impossible, not even close to possible, right? There's a little fact or myth for you there. It is a myth. If anyone tells you you can learn everything in cybersecurity, that's never going to be the case. But not everyone is willing to go the distance and like really put in that work. And not everyone has you know, such a burning interest in this stuff that they're going to go out and be a self-learner, right? Some people would prefer jobs where what they need to know is very clearly defined and jobs that they can kind of master and, you know, maybe they, they get complacent in their jobs and things like that. This is a job that you can't really, I feel you can't really get complacent in. I mean, you know, there might be certain companies you can work for where a lot of people are unfortunately a bit complacent, but what I'm speaking of is that if you want to get into this field, right, and you're coming from a different background, like maybe you don't even have the IT background per se, or you don't have any security credentials yet, but you want to get into this field. I mean, not everyone can, but I will say if what I just described was you, you want to get into this field, right? That's the key that you want to, right? You really want to, not just for the pay, but because you enjoy uh, you enjoy security. You enjoy that kind of mindset of the hacker mindset, trying to find flaws and things. And you have that curiosity, just that natural curiosity about things. Then I would say there is a space for you, right? But what I'm saying when I, when I make this statement, not anyone can become a pen tester, not just anyone, is that not, you know, most people won't have the drive that I'm talking about right now. But if you want to be here, then there is definitely a space for you. There's so many ways you can get into this field. We talk about that in other videos. So many different ways you can provide value to a security team as well. We talk about that a lot, certainly. And, you know, ultimately what it comes down to is, is this something that you're truly interested in? Not just for the money, but you're cur you know, you, you fit the mold, right? You are a self-learner. You're naturally curious about things. You're interested in this field. There is a place in here for you. So this factor myth, like it really depends, right? But if you're watching this video, chances are if you're watching this, the videos that I make you know, on this channel, then you don't even have anything to worry about. There is a space for you as a pen tester. So just stay the course. Kind of a short video, but I really wanted to get that out there. I know this is a question that a lot of people have. I've heard people ask before. I really wanted to break it down for you guys. So Thanks for watching. If you watched to this point, be sure to subscribe, hit the like button as well to help get the message out there. And if you want to continue down your path of learning, check out the Absolute Beginner's Guide to Ethical Hacking playlist on the screen now. I'll see you guys right over in those videos. Thanks for watching.